Hari Om. Welcome to our next Bhagavad Gita video lesson. Let's start with our slow deep breath to prepare ourselves. Hari Om Tatsa. Om Shanti. 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 This is episode number 63 called, It's the Attitude, Not the Outcome. And I want to stick with the, the theme and the message of, the la of last week and probably the last few weeks from the second chapter, the 32nd verse, where Krishna says to Arjuna that by engaging in this battle in front of him, it will open the gates of heaven. Even if Arjuna dies supporting, defending the Dharma, championing the, Dharma, the course of Dharma, he's going to enter what Krishna calls Virga Swasam, the heaven of the heroes. For us, for us, this means that even if we feel we've been defeated in our Dharmic battle within us, we feel that the deep-seated patterns of the ego have overpowered the aspirations of our soul. Neil Desperum, the fat lady, hasn't sung yet. Even if there's a little bit of sincerity in our efforts, then some good result has taken place, though unseen by us at the moment. It's our attitude, not the outcome, that unlocks the gates of heaven. This happens even while we're still living in the physical body. And when it does come time to cast aside this mortal frame, Saint Peter or Saint Michael or whoever is at the gate, he or she will check our records, see that we face our dilemmas, doing the best we could to hold on to our higher self and that the these situations serve their spiritual purpose and will be waved through the gate and welcomed home. Our homework assignment could be consider a time when you feel you've let yourself, maybe others down. Close your eyes for a moment and settle into that and feel that even if you learned a little bit from that experience and became a, a little better person, feel that the gates are still wide open for you. Thank you so much. See you next week. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti.